what does all this imply for the modern yarn mm -hmm. Indian? Okay, this is, this is a very good question. This is a very, very good question because that is one of my main targets. Uh, when you find a, a, this onslaught of digestion going on very rapidly through language, through aesthetics, you know, Western aesthetics are popular, uh, Western economic structure, everybody, and materialism and the philosophical things. And Indian uh, in civilization getting digested and then re-exported re back, and that exported version is the one that Indians will accept. Uh, then one strategy, rather than fighting a battle you can't win, one strategy is to take what has been U-turned and brought back and link it to the source from where it came. So you go to the Elliot guy and you tell him the ones who are studying English honors, keep studying Elliot, but these are the sources where he got these particular passages from to reignite that interest. To you go to the neuroscientists who are beginning to welcome all these American uh, who, who are bringing the latest uh, men mental health models and you show that these are the Indian sources where they actually got this from to give them, to give some new respect to the Indian sources. So one of the purposes I have is actually to take the Western usages and Western appropriations and not, I can't stop anything and I'm not interested in stopping, nor do I think they could or should stop, but to reconnect them back to the source roots which have, that link has been broken. However it's been broken, it's not that it's anybody's fault, but the fact is that it's broken. Because when Gardner comes to Infosys and IIT Chennai, nobody knows that there is any relationship. And when people look at Maslow's, you know, pyramid structure of needs and all, they don't think that the punch kosha, you know, the, the Annamaya kosha is his biological level and what, how he's developed it and all. You have to really go back in, and do forensic research in the history of psychology and transpersonal psychology to pick up these links. So by picking up these links and presenting them back to modern people, hopefully it gives them some uh, excitement about their own civilization. So that is my small, humble contribution in linking this back. That's all I can do.